Chris Crudell is opening up about suddenly becoming the acting president at Florida Atlantic University. He took over amid turmoil. News Channel 5's Marissa Bag was the first reporter to sit down with him. She's live now with how he's handling controversy and his vision for the future. Marissa. Yeah, Kelly, I'm told acting president has the same powers and responsibilities that the permanent president does here at FAU. And in the acting role, Crudell says that he wants better pay for faculty, but he'll have to iron out a few kinks first. It's only been a week, and already Dennis Crudell is feeling the pressure president of FAU brings. But it's a lot different being president, I found out already, He's just if nothing else from the social events. You know, I thought I was putting in a lot of hours as we went by. I'm finding out I'm putting in a lot more. Crudell accepted the acting president role when Dr. Mary Jane Saunders resigned from the post. She cited recent controversies as part of her reason for leaving. Well, I'm sure that she felt uh, a lot of that pressure that she was going through at that time and I'm and I'm and I'm sure from her she thought this was going to be a fresh start uh, she felt like uh, the university I believe needed that Stand for Jesus. one issue still troubles the religious community the fate of professor DeAndre Poole remains unknown after a student complained about a class assignment involving the name of Jesus Governor Rick Scott got involved, and Crudell says FAU will have an answer soon. We have got to get over some of these issues. I want to hand over to the next president, whoever that is, as clean a slate as I can. We want to be uh, more decisive. We want to we want to be more responsive, and we want we want to be more transparent. Students have their opinions on what they want to see from Crudell. I would like to see him address the students more, explain kind of what's happening, so it's not just hearsay, but he can actually address the situation of Saunders resigning. I hope he just keeps up with what Saunders did with um, community and whatnot because she always was around or came around and everyone knew her and loved her when she came. As for the president's mansion, Crudell will not be moving in. He says he doesn't expect to be in the role of president for very long. Besides, he says Mary Jane Saunders does still live here, at least for now. Reporting live in Boca Raton, I'm Marissa Bag, WPTV News Channel 5.